ISL 207. That's what's on the wrist today. This is the Islander JFK Automatic GMT with the blue cloud dial. Just picked this one up. I thought I'd share it with below entry level Tommy viewers. And um, get it out there. This watch is gorgeous. Um, if you're not familiar with the Islander brand, Mark is a watch enthusiast. He is the owner of the Islander brand and does a phenomenal job giving us um, good quality watch, enthusiast type watch for a reasonable sale price. So I've been a fan since I discovered Islander brand and um, I own quite a few at the moment. And this was another one that Ryan designed and I had to have just as soon as I saw it. So let's go over the specs. 42 millimeter case diameter, 14.5 millimeters thick. So on the chunky side, 47.8 millimeter lug to lug with drilled lugs. Then we have 20 millimeter lug width. 8 millimeter onion style crown, which is abnormal for a diver, I am aware. Signed, giving us 200 meter water resistant or 660 feet. Bi directional stainless steel bezel insert. Blue paint on the bezel. Very small dome, but domed sapphire crystal with anti reflective coating embossed screw down case back new milled clasp with six micro adjustments and the islander engraved on the locking part of the clasp i super dig this watch like i said this is an islander jfk automatic gmt and uh it's just clean done right Date window was framed at the 6 o'clock. Who doesn't love that? Stainless steel bezel insert with the blue paint. It's dark. It goes with the darker chapter ring and the anodized looking hands and indices. We have green superluminova for loom. Crown at the 4 o'clock. Just hits all the mark. Nice case design. I like the way it kind of... Uh, Flares out and then right back in. Very nice looking design. I'm not a big fan of the flat edge case. And this one has a unique style to me. I've never really noticed another one that is so tapered in. It looks really good. Screw in links. So you have screw links to remove links or add links which is very nice it, mark always provides a screwdriver so any islander you buy that has screw and links will um you'll get a screwdriver with it which is awesome um no quick release on the bracelet but you do have the drill lugs so you don't really need it but just gorgeous 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 dial let me know what you guys think. Do you dig the dial? I think it looks great. I love the texture, the billowiness of the uh, clouds. This is called the blue cloud dial. Um, there is also a white variation and a gray variation. Um, blue is my color. I went with blue. And this is the only one that had the stainless steel bezel. So that really attracted me. It's different. Um, they all do have bi-directional bezels. And I believe um, on the video Marks did, they all have um, uh, different bracelets as well. So that's something unique. Let's get you a loom shot. And then we will wrap this video up. Hope you enjoyed the video. Much love to you all. Let's kill the lights. And there it is. Great loom, green superluminova. The GMT hand does have blue on the arrow. 
but all the rest indices and hands are green. Like I said, great looking watch. Let me know what you guys think and stay tuned for the next Saturday drop on below entry level Tommy. If you haven't subscribed, please do so. Hit that like button and check out my main channel. Tommy Big Time. Much love.